how something unexpected happened today uh, on a set uh, shooting our usual skit. Uh, I saw this vulture, honestly speaking, I was surprised because I have not seen a vulture physically before, one on one before. So I was very, very surprised. I decided to uh, get closer to half. A close look at it. It was an attempt of getting close to the vulture. Oh my goodness. I saw this woman picking uh, waste from the rubbish down. It was something touching. It was it touched me a lot. So I just diverted and get close to her. I decided to have a conversation with her to find out what she's doing on such on decent environment. Oh, to my surprise, and this is speaking, not everybody you see on such environments that is not normal or is mad. She is really, really a normal human being. I asked her why. Um, she is speaking like I want to know the, the, the reason why she's speaking uh, the waste from the rubbish dump and she said um, that's what she does for a living I said wow so I, I was asking uh, is she not having a husband um, so he, the husband died a few years ago uh, leaving three kids it's such a sad story so um, as a result of um, some financial problem and then also you know one or two reasons she end up uh, picking such ways and then you but you gather them sell it pick gather them sell it that's what she used to do and then and a living so i said wow so i i further asked fine if that's what you're doing then it's, it's not a bad business but but then why didn't you pick from a decent place or decent places because we have so many places you can get this rubber or this plastic waste. And uh, she, as to my surprise, she said, usually that's what she has been doing. And I say speaking, she has been picking from decent places. But whenever she gets, she, she try to get close to those, uh, they, they try to sack her as a result of her appearance. People also mistake her of being mad or maybe something like that. So she decided not to go there again or go to any decent place that somebody human being may see. Yeah. Always try to come to the refuge dam and then pick the waste from there. So over there, I think from her, her, her speech, she simply wants to avoid embarrassment from human beings. Yes. Or if I can go there to pick and then uh, I will get this challenger. Let me just come to the refuge dam and then pick. So I was like, wow. So that's the main reason why. I was so 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 surprised. So just just imagine the environment. Just look at how the environment is. And then even you see vulture on that rubbish dump to tell you how the place is thinking. Honestly speaking, it's them stinking. Me getting close, I was even not uh, feeling comfortable. That because of the vulture. I swear. So I asked of a location like where she's staying, and then it's not. It's not uh, it's just a few miles from where she's picking the, the waste. So I promised her I'll be paying her visit one day. Yes, so I think one day I'll have to try and get to where she's staying. So that we continue the conversation from there. I think whenever next time when I'm going, I have to prepare myself at least. <laughs> it's a touching story. Ash. So that at least I can give her something. Yeah, so I think this is what you have to be doing. Please, um, it's not everybody you see on on the streets. It's not everybody you see on a tattered cloth and then you just jump into conclusion that he or she is smart. We really, really need to render a helping hand to such people. And then also before you do that, you can try getting close to the person or the fellow and then uh, ask him or her one or two questions you realize that 90 percent of all those people we are seeing some of them are sound yes they're sound in mind they're not bad so you can see you just said you can see the environment wow i just i just, I just, I just placed my mother in her shoes 
uh, today. That's why it's, un it's unusual, something unexpected. I wasn't expecting. You see, a woman. She looks very beautiful. She's a nice woman. Yeah, she's a nice woman. She's speaking very well. Yes, I really enjoy the conversation with her. And I just like how she just, she just <laughs> welcomed me once. She allowed me to ask her questions. She's just talking to me. You know, people like she, she, she open up. She open up, feeling free. She, she, she's telling you what she's up to. Yes, it's true. Wow, so uh, no, our next, our next, our next, next, next trip we'll try and then pay her visit at home. Then we continue the conversation from there. I think she's having more to tell me, yeah, or she's having more to tell us the whole world so that we can learn something from it. People like this really need helping hands. <laughs> Oh, you make me cry. It's gonna be enemy.